Girl, see, I just told y'all she don't cook. I just told y'all she don't cook. Sis, what is this? Sis. We don't have time for this. Sis. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Queen, and today we're gonna be playing Design of My Life. Today we have a couple plans. We want to get a dog. We want to try to get a promotion. We have a couple things we're working on here. Um, and she may want a bigger house, but I mean we're kind of broke right now. Um, but yeah, this house is so small, so she may want a bigger house because she's thinking about getting getting with that um that guy Samir. But before we get started, please make sure you don't forget to like, sub, turn on post notifications so you know how to see first. I appreciate everybody who's been here before, coming back to support, and everybody who's new, welcome in your family now. There's no way to get out of the situation. <laughs> um, but yeah, so let's get into it. So she's, um, it's 6.30. Let's wake her up because this girl's always late to work. Always. Always late to work. Well, she's not late, but she like um goes without eating and taking care of herself and stuff. So we just have her take care of herself real quick, and she can brush her teeth and um let's uh, also make her something to eat real quick. Now she's not a big cooker, uh, it's just not her thing. But she's gonna where is your um. Hold on. Child, where is the um cooking book? Oh, right here. Like, what's going on? All right, so she's going to um make some breakfast. And I think she's going to make uh, some honey banana toast. Just a single serving because she ain't got nobody to come over. So, if you guys are new, we have a best friend that lives next door. We just met her. Her name is Asia. She's really, really pretty. And the guy who lives next door to her is, uh, or lives next door to both of us, is Samir. Now, if you guys don't know Samir, Samir is from our um, Zodiac Legacy Challenge on Twitch. So, if anybody from Twitch sees this, they're going to be like, why is um, Jose Kid over here? <laughs> and that's a love family that's from Zodiac Legacy but yeah I'm thinking about getting her a pet today I wanted her to have a cat because I cannot do dogs in the city girl see I just told y'all she don't cook I just told y'all she don't cook sis what is this sis we don't have time for this sis oh my gosh oh my gosh <sighs> Work on my butt. You just did all this, and then you can clean the floor up. I don't know if we have to replace this or not. I can't even figure out how. Child, mm. I just told y'all she don't cook. Girl, take the food out. Oh, is the food coming soon? It's already eight o'clock. Sis, what's going on? I guess the food is still cooking. That's weird. All right, so um, why would you put that on the ground? Eat this, because you is crazy. Child, well, that, that, if that's not an intro to the, 
to the game. I don't know what it is. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is this? I heard you became friends with Asia. She's pretty cool. Yes, yeah, she is pretty cool. Ma, Ma, what, what you got on Ma? We need to get Mom a makeover. Oh, what's today's project? Where are we going? Oh, Okay, we going to who house? Jones. Okay, let's get to work. Time to proceed ahead to the client's lot. Getting there on time can be a good opportunity to get to know the client. Likes and dislikes. Ready to head over? So we're here. We're at our client's house, and you never will guess where we're at. We at home. Ma, Ma, you you signed us up to be a client. What? Ma, I have actual work to do, Ma. Like, why would you sign up to be a client? Ma, Ma. <laughs> Where's she at? We just have to do any uh, renovation. Where's she at though? Oh, right here on the computer. Oh, she got on though. Oh no, she got on cue outfit. So we're going to uh, call her over. She's like, come on over. She like, ma. Now, why would you sign up to be a client? Let's give her a hug because this is our mom. Um, <laughs> we not asking to come home. No. Um, can we give her a loving hug? Hug lovingly. She's like, Ma, now why would you ask me to, girl, damn, you have some service. And uh, she like, Ma, now why would you ask me to be, um, a client? Like, Ma, I got an extra job to do. She like, I know, it's just that. You know, if you want to do this and not go to college like I want you to, then I want to see your work in action. I heard that you've been doing really well, and I want to, I want to, you know, pay you to do our house. And she's like, oh, my. She's like, how are you? Girl, where are you going? Are there no other chairs over here? She like, girl, what's up with your legs? So we just go start asking her questions, like, um, we're going to fly about our knowledge in it. Like, so I've done this house, this house, and this house, and I've did this and this or whatever. And now we're going to ask her, like, when was your favorite color? And what's your favorite design? <laughs> That's so cute. So what color do you like them? Garden decor, okay. Not you sitting down in her chair. She's like, so what you like, Ma? We're trying to figure out what you like. Uh, 
Oh yeah, we need to talk about her, our promotion. She like games. And she likes the color black. Okay, so we're gonna do an office thing, guys. Um, what are we gonna do? Uh, we wanna talk to her about our promotion, ask about hobbies and skills. Ma. Ma. So. She like you still got all your stuff up, messed up in your room. Go here. She like mine is my old room. She like, but you never cleaned it up. Um. She's like um. What hobby and skills are you into? Common successful renovation. It's like, and you're gonna love what we do. What are your hobbies and skills? We ain't getting a notification of her saying what it was. Um, did you tell her about the promotion? We gonna talk about to her about other stuff. We gonna ask her for love advice. Like, mom, what you think? I like this guy. She like how you how, how did you meet him? Well, he's my next door neighbor. She like, mm, I don't know about that, baby, because he lives next door to you. Now, if y'all break up, then what you gonna do? Because he lives next door to you. All right, well, I guess we uh, we never get no more information from her. Okay, so apparently, uh, girl, Come downstairs, cause we're we're gonna make over. I think I want to make over her office, um, because she wants gaming stuff, and she don't really have a big outside now. She does have a big lot, but I don't wanna. I already tried that before, like decorating before we even left. So um, before we moved out, so I think I wanna do her office, or something like that. This office is already cute though. Maybe when she came upstairs to our bedroom, she was um, telling us that, you know, maybe she wanted this room done, which we could turn into like another space for her. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Um, okay, well, let's just... Okay, let's let's take previous photos here. Take before photos. I think I want to do this one because her office is so cute already. I don't want to mess it up.
Can we, um... She like yellow and black. She don't like green. Oh, she like any decor, really. She likes modern decor, boho, suburban, contemporary, garden, patio decor. Okay. Um... Okay, um, she like black and yellow. Okay, um, we're going to ask her to leave, um, and then we're going to get started. Okay, so let's send client away. She's like, all right, Ma, I got to decorate right now, uh, but you got to go. Yep, we gotta go. Alright, so where's she going? I right, bet. So I think I wanna do this room because she was just like, this room is so dirty still. Like, I mean, I could clean it back to you, but I almost want to keep it the same. And then she like, but now I'm thinking like I may wanna change it. So we're gonna do this room. We know what she likes, so let's let's hit that. Okay. Um we're going to start messing with stuff in here. What? Child, what? This is not the room? I thought it was for any room. Geek level renovation, sets and I, client. Okay. Can what what can I work on? Hmm. But I can't work up here, right? And I can't drag either. Okay, so she don't want this upstairs mess with. Yeah, I can't mess with anything up here. She wants something downstairs mess with. So I'm guessing it is her office. Okay, guys, we're back. And I want to have a quick conversation about how I'm feeling and... Just get into how I'm feeling. Y'all, I can't. I just cannot. I am over decorating. I'm over it. Like, it's giving me a headache at this point just to have to sit there for... And you may see it take five minutes for me to decorate. It takes hours. And I'm cutting out hours of footage. We're speeding it up so fast that it looks like my video is like 20 minutes and it took like two hours to make because I'm sitting there decorating for two hours because I'm not a decorator. Now, if you are somebody who enjoys decorating in The Sims, it probably would take you like 30 minutes and your whole place would be done. But for somebody who doesn't like decorating or building in The Sims, it takes me ages. So I've thought about it and thought about it and thought about it and we're quitting it. Yeah. I like um, Sierra. I think that's her name, right? Yeah, I like Sierra. Um, child, don't put these walls down. So it's driving me crazy at this point. Um, and I want to continue her story. But, and look, look who outside. Who is this? Somebody outside. Anyway, I want to continue her story. But guys, we're going to quit our job and get us a new job. Because... I, I understand that this is designing my life, but we're going to have to switch it up, okay? Because I do I hate making videos of this LP because I have to spend 
ages decorating something. I just, I'm giving up. I'm giving up. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to be searching for a new job, searching for new things to do. I just, I cannot. I cannot. So that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Uh, I want to know your feelings. Did you like me decorating? I, I just, I just don't like doing it. But Samir's out here and it said, yo, anyone up for get, um, getting their exercise on? Because I'm here to pump, clap you up. Ciao. Samir. Go work out. She's like, yeah, I can work out. She's like, what are we going to do? Child, but you want to work out in my house? Don't think of babies because, baby, we won't be having any of those. Okay, Samir, basically, I know what kind of workout you meant now. And, uh, sir, we're not doing that. What you want? I want to see. I want to see y'all work out. Oh, he like, no, let's go on the floor. Let's work out. She like, in this tiny-ass apartment, Samir? Samir. <laughs> what am I going to do in this tiny apartment? She like, let's just go to the gym at this point. But come over here and, um... Go kiss your boom. And, um... They cute. Look at Asia. Asia. Asia, you want to come with us, boo? Asia, she like, bitch, you left me last time. She like, yeah, because um, I stay hang out. I want all of us to be friends together. Asia's so pretty. Anyway, go ahead. Go no ask her to hang out. She like, you want to work out? We going to the gym. She like, are you going to start? She like, I got to find me a boot because you be doing too much. Look at them. They so cute. Oh, she said no. Anyway, um, we going to the gym. So get your, um, we going to travel. With Samir, he wants to go work out. So we are at the gym, and um, I am, we are going to go over here together. I know where y'all going. I want to see. I just want to let them do their own thing, honestly. Oh, she wanted to get on there, and he wanted to come talk. She like, I thought you wanted to work out. I'm trying to work out. Okay, sis, I see you. I see you, sis. Oh, you struggling. Struggle a little bit. It's only like two on there, though. Um, you got this? And Samir over here talking. Jose and them have cute ass kids. Jose babies is cute, baby. So, once we get off of that machine, I want her to go work out over here. She's going to practice punching. She's like, come on. Let's get this. Samir, you had me come to this gym and you don't even want to work out. You want to talk to people? We're trying to get this up. 
Just in case we need to fight somebody. What? I've called you. <gasps> what? I've called to inform you that your great grand second once removed cousin's friend grandpa has passed away and left for some reason left you a vast fortune. Specifically to you, will you accept? Money, money, money. What's she gonna say? I think she will ask, like, okay, so what do I have to do, though, to get the money? Very clever. Well, there was some conditions, but one of the conditions were, was there would be no conditions if you asked if there were any conditions. So there are no conditions. Wait, right? So we got 2500 straight like that. Straight like that. Straight, straight, straight like that. Hey, 2500 Straight like that. Push the limits. Push the limits. Push the limits. She like, hold on. I'm going to give me a shower. And then me and Samir can probably go out on a date or something. Um, You can come down here. You can take you. You can do what you want to do, baby. She like, um... Oh no, you funky funky. Hold on. You can't be doing that. That's that's um, you funky funky. But y'all can do something while y'all at the gym. You gonna just take a shower um by yourself first. <laughs> uh take your quick shower. Alright, my guess it's it's already eight o'clock. We're trying to go out to dinner or something. So let me get in the shower and then her and which y'all probably gonna do something at the gym because you know how she is. Or yeah, you know how she is because she didn't want to start it last time. Bitch, get out the bathtub. Bitch, will you see us in the motherfucking bathroom with your whole ass? She like, bitch, why the fuck would you even do some shit like that? Take her money. Bitch ass. That's why we got five hundred dollars from you. Anyway, we gonna come over here and we'll hook with Samir. Uh, no, we can't do that. Should I go away? Go away. Go away. All right, then you gonna hook with Samir. You got condoms, right? You took your birth control pill, right? Okay, you did. And you got condoms. Perfect. What? So her and Samir are about to woohoo in the shower because she and him are freaky AF and they just do whatever the fuck they want to do whenever they want to do it, honey. And, you know, this is a little day for her. She's like, oh, this is a cute, like, little... She like, she wants some, so I'm going to let her do her. You know, we're not going to judge. We're just going to let her do her and mind our business. Okay, sis. She going to end in the shower. Cha. She all uncomfortable because she's tired as hell. No protection was used. Bitch, hold up. Uh-uh. I gave you protection. Come over here, because you, you play too damn much for me. She's like, I'm tired. I'm going to go home in a minute. I got to pee, and I'm going home. Our mom is here. Our mom is here. She like... 
I know. What's she doing here at this gym? We gonna be like, she did not see us. You ain't pregnant, it's okay. Thank God. Okay, so what does it say? Intense itching. He gave her crab legs? Girl, what? Oof. Girl, go home. We're going to have to talk to him because she like, did you get me crazy? Like, I don't think so. But it, the reason why I'm not like, okay, well, he needed to get his ass beat is because in The Sims, crab lice is like a neighbor. You can get it from everything. And it's so weird. It's, it's, sometimes in Sims, you can get like uh, another like type of disease. And then you go to the partner to test the partner and they don't have shit. It's just the game. It's just a mod in the game messing with each other. Okay. Okay, so go ahead, sis. Let's roll. She like, oh, he gave me crabs. Ooh, that's us for All right, guys, she's going to head off to bed. Um, the woohoo was bad, and she felt like he gave her crap lies, which... Oh, roaches. 
smoke to the house. So we are going to be trying to move up out of here. We're going to have to um, chat with him real quick. Hold on. She had more money than this. Okay, guys. We are back. And she's been sad today. Um, because <laughs> she's sad because she's hungry and because she's still from working out. And because she had roaches. Mm -hmm. So I want to um, let's have her make some breakfast. We're going to try again today. To make some breakfast, we're just gonna chow some eggs and toast. We're gonna talk to Bay. Actually, I'm gonna go into his world and see if he has my um, lice. Hold on. So, this is why I didn't pay much attention to the crabs because I'm in Samir's world and he does not have it. Um, because this is how the game just does. So, that's why I didn't pay too much attention to it. Um, let's have him go get tested though, just to be careful. Go get tested. Let's well, take Samara's back from a medical test and it turns out that he does not have any WTDs. And this is exactly why I don't freak out sometimes when I get a WTD from a sim. Because it's hard to explain. The mod can't control both of the sims i feel like sometimes sometimes it control one of the sims and it's just something that happens in the game but it don't control both of the sims so um it just that's why because i you know typically <laughs> if my sim has something from somebody we're gonna beat that person the fuck up but i've learned from twitch chat who actually told me that it, you can get that from just sitting on a bed because of how often you get it in the sims So I just wanted to touch on that real quick because I know you guys are probably like queen you didn't flip out, didn't flip out. It's because he don't have it. How she get it from herself. It's, it's, it's not adding up. So um, Let's get back to business I just wanted to show y'all some here because I wanted to make sure that he didn't have anything because if he do Then you know, it's up for him for real for real um, but he would don't have anything. What's stank? What's stank, sis? What's stank? Where is the stank at? Is there a smell somewhere that I'm not seeing? Anyway, uh, let's get to business. We don't want to do that career anymore, or I don't want to do that career anymore because I feel like um, I just don't want to do it. So what we're going to do is come over here and... Oh, she's not, we need to change this because she's not um, going to college. Uh, let's see. Maybe that. Anyway, um, we're going to go and find a new job because I just feel like it's just, she don't want to do this. Um, we're going to find our, a new job. She like, I mean, I like decorating a lot. And I love interior design. It's just a lot of work for a little bit of money. We have to decorate like a whole outside area. Spend hours doing it for $800. It's just like the money's not adding up. Yeah, we're going to quit our job and try to be work at a daycare. And yeah, we quit that. So we just... Yeah, we're just going to quit that. Um, we work in two days. So, I guess today we can go out and have fun. It's all rainy and stuff. But we need to find a way to make money for us, too. Can we work in this and also have a freelance career? Okay, guys. Um, finally, before I forget to do anything, let's um, come over here. Let's see if we're going to adopt a cat. Okay. 
Oreos cute. So, okay, I want to see if I can get a kid in. Um, our space is small, but what's dirty to you? Oh, nothing. Okay. Um, oh, this is on the ground, sis. Come clean this up. Clean this up. Where is the animals, Miss Ma'am? Oh, right here. Look at them. Oh my god, how cute. Where's the other ones? Oh, right here. Oh, we may have more than one, guys. They're just too cute. All right, let's do a close-up of each of the babies. Child, so irritating. Okay. All right, go say hi to everybody. <laughs> Look at the little gray kitten. I'm oh, so cute. Look at her being adorable. Oh, you are mean. We are not getting your bit. Yo, we're not getting you, Oreo. Oreo is mean, y'all. Look at her. Oh my gosh. So adorable. Look at this one on the ground. Okay, so we already know Oreo is mean, so we're not going to be getting Oreo, but let's um, play with the laser pointer. She's cute. They're both cute. I think I may get both of them, guys. <laughs> You're very vocal. So cute! Sir. What? Who's peeping in my house? Anyway, 
Yeah, we don't want that shit at all. Because I will kill him. Okay, girl. You had your whole time to do that with her. We need to talk to them more. Look at her, she's so cute. <laughs> Miss Kitty is so cute. She want all the attention. You, Oreo, you will not be getting adopted. I'm sorry, Oreo. You hissed at that lady. We don't want a mean kid. Sorry. We want to get to know him, though. Oh, you love us? Girl, I'm not you yelling at my motherfucking cat. You can get beat the fuck up. I will watch your mouth. I would definitely watch your mouth when it comes to my future kidding before you get actually smacked the fuck about up. You know what? Just don't have money. It's fine. He's affectionate. And we wasn't talking to him. Yep, bitch, we stole your money. Next time you want to raise your voice at my cat, you'll know better. Anyway, we need to find out what's up with him. Was she being mean to him or something? Because we didn't talk to that one because of it. Um, we need to get to know. Because you were hissing at her, and that's why we didn't talk to you. Frisky, that's what it was. That's why you were tissing at her. Yeah, I want all three of them. All right, y'all, let's adopt the cats we want. I don't think Oreo fits in with our style, even though I love Oreo and I think Oreo is so pretty. Because we try to be kind to people until they play with us. And Oreo is so cute. But these cats over here are kinder than Oreo. This is my little baby right here. Alright, you know what? We're going to adopt the dog, adopt the cats. Oreo is kind of frisky. I don't know if I want Oreo. Adopt. Yep, we want to adopt them. And this her name is it a boy or a girl though? Um. We gonna name it Milo because we don't know what they are. So uh, we also wanna adopt you. She's like, are you gonna adopt me? We're gonna adopt you. We need to know you uh, what are you, what do you like, um, Oreo? He's like, babe, you getting a dog? I mean, a cat. Um, and we're going to come over here and kiss him. And he likes her. He's like, babe, you're not going to adopt this one. I like him. 
She's like, okay, I like him too. I just don't know if he's going to be nice to other cats. Oh, no. Bitch. Bitch. Bitch, I won't, bitch. Bitch, I will beat you the fuck up. Where my cat at? She took him back. Bring my cats back. End of adoption. End it. And then bring them the fuck back. End it. End it. Cause she like, I really could beat your ass. Bring bring them the back bring them back. Where are they at? I don't see them no more. Bring them back. End it. Get up out of here so we can call you back. Feel this. But do we have enough room for three cats, y'all? I don't think so. Call my Lila E. But I want them. They're so cute. And he likes one of them. Where's my Lila? at? <laughs> Look at little Milo. I want them all, y'all. I ain't okay. I want them all. She like, that lady took the pets back before I got a chance to even tell her which one I wanted. She's like, let me call her back because I like the ones that I was talking to. It was Oreo and it was Miss Kitty. Call them back. We was not done. And we lost all our friendship with them. So this is for Bear. Okay, because I know Bear's like, Queen, you took the uh, cat out uh single mom family. We did. But look at all the babies that we're about to get now. Where they at? Look at them right there. Okay, so we already know that one of them is frisky, but our boyfriend, who's going to be our boyfriend, he just don't know it yet, likes them. Go talk to the baby. Oh! Sis, sis, you ain't got no room for this, sis. But you better, eh, eh. Yeah, you better, eh, eh. You get it? Okay, go ahead, sis. Hey there, the water's out of my place and I kind of need a shower. Samir, you was just over here. Um, invite in. Allow him to shower. She likes Samir, now you know. Your ass is just over here. Y'all, we gotta get the fuck out of here, honestly. We got mice in this bitch. Do cats kill the mice? She's like, go take a shower, baby. And now she's going to come over here and pet commonly. Some mice in the house and stuff. Like she like, I gotta get out of here. Like honestly, I want a bigger house for my kittens. What happened to the other one right here? <laughs> Look at Milo. He likes my family's back.
Oreo? You don't like the microwave, Oreo? And then let me take care of the trash since you let me take a shower in here. You're like, this landlord is trash. She's like, I know. I'm trying to get, move out. What the fuck is going on in the apartment? Like, everything's going wrong, guys. We may move out of here, honestly. Because, um, where's the, the box? Hold up. What the hell is going on? Everything in this bitch is going wrong. It's the real tea. Everything in here that can go wrong is going wrong. And she like, I'm not finna deal with this. Like, what is going on? Where's the sparkling box? I don't know. But anyway, she like, um, uh, she like, I think I want all three. Like, you and all three look at it. She's like, I kind of want all three. I'm not sure, though. All right, go ahead, baby. <laughs> Look at them. It's over there. Oh, it's this. Uh, some here. Not you busting a dollar for this lady. Some here. Should I? I really hate this problem. But before they leave again, y'all. We need to just adopt them. We adopting all three kitties. Um, we're not adopting this one for us, even though we love the, all the kitties. We're adopting them because Samir loves this one. And he like, if we ever was to like move in, I like Oreo the best. So you got an issue, sir? Cause we got it, we can fix those issues. Her name is gonna be Sophie. Like it's fucking rats and shit in here. Why are you going up to my room, sir? If you sit down in my room, let me adopt this this uh, cat real quick before we um go to jail. Where where's the cat at, baby? Where's the cat that you love at? Did the lady take him again? No. Where the baby at? Actually, guys, I don't want her to adopt him because I feel like that she don't vibe with that cat. I want him to adopt that cat. So let me, um, yeah, let me see if he gonna fix some shit. If he ain't, yeah, we gonna give this cat to him. That's gonna be, um, uh, his cat. What, what you doing up here, sir? Because I know you see that's the issue down there. Let me move this out the way, see if that's what's causing the problem.
Uh, she like, are you going to um fix what's down here? It's a lot of cats. We only got two in our household. One gonna be in his household because he was like, get Oreo for me. I want Oreo. If you walk in this bathroom, where she at? I'm gonna walk in and beat your ass. Fix it, sir. Fix it. Okay, so are you going to fix the issue or no? Are you going to fix the issue? She's like, are you going to fix the issue or no? So my baby, go home. So my hair, what the baby do? Don't be mean to him. Uh-uh. We don't do that here. We don't do that here, little cat. Mm-mm. No, no, no. Oh, it's a mouse over here. Obliterate. Can you, can you take care of this or no? You see these fucking mice running around my house? She's like, babe, how are you living here? She's like, yeah, I don't know. I just don't have the money to leave. It's fucking mice here. I'm going to move this so he can get rid of them damn mice. He's like, it's trifling in this house. You need to get out of here. She's like, babe, I am trying. I just moved in. I like, I don't have money like that right now to like just be moving and stuff. I don't really have the money for that. Like, I'm trying to save up to get a better house. But right now, this is all I can afford. Are you done, sir? You don't see these mice? Obliterate the fucking mice. Get the mice. And he's like, sir, Samir is taking over now because he's like, why the fuck aren't you doing anything? Why aren't you doing anything? Why aren't you doing anything? Do you not know how to do your job? Uh -uh, don't go to work now, baby. Don't go to work now. He set that ass. Where you going? He like you see these mice in here. You see, you see the roaches on the wall. You see shit broken here, and you leave it. You leaving? He like, I cannot take this shit no more. I cannot take this shit no more. Like, you up in here acting a fucking fool. Complaining about your issues. Like, you don't see the fucking problems in this bitch? Oh, my gosh. He's like, you don't see that there's fucking roaches and rats all over this fucking apartment? You don't see that? You don't see that, sir? And you walking the fuck out of here like shit is sweet. You don't see that? You got my girl living here and she like your girl. Um, you living here under this nasty shit? It's fucking trash. You don't know how to do your job? You don't know how to do your job, sir? You don't know how to do your job? You don't know how to do your job? Why the fuck are you even working here if you don't know how to do your job? Like you not gonna clean up her fucking house? You not gonna you not gonna clean up her house? You not gonna fix the shit that you see that's wrong? You gonna walk out of here and leave this shit right there? Alright. He's like, I do my job. I'm just very busy. He's like, who the fuck you think you lying to, though? He's like, oh my god, there's so much pressure. Pressure my ass. You don't do anything but talk. 
I'm not even gonna pay much to do this. Okay, you took that job, not us. Yeah, like, let me talk to you in the hallway. I don't want to argue in the presence of a lady. Stay in the house, babe. We'll be back. My email, my new business, pool. Okay. So, he has an issue with this whole thing. He like, to you telling me, what you, what you telling me is... Instead of you cleaning up this house and trying to fix the stuff that you see that's wrong, you're going to ignore it. Is that what you're telling me? Is that what you're telling me, sir? Don't lose, bro. Don't lose. Oh, you be, he got you, I try to ask me, what is your fitness? He like, okay, you, you won, you won. He like, yeah, I beat your ass. He like, but shit ain't over till I say it's over. All right, it's never gonna be over. Ty says it's over, and so put them um, get ready for another fight. Cause bitch, you got the game twisted. If you think you're just gonna get off like that, but I get your ass beat again. She said, he said, so now we even, bitch. We're going to take it a little bit farther, though. A little bit farther. Oh, no, not that far. So it's money. Like, why the fuck would you hit me? He's like, yeah, I got your money now, bro. It's all broke ass. All you hear was $100. Um, Yeah, I said, but in the future, do your motherfucking job. How about that? How about that? In the future, do your fucking job. You got my my good sis, my my girlfriend living living in this in disgusting shit. She got roaches. She got rats. She just moved in there, so she ain't had that shit before she got here. But you knew you been had that stuff. You knew you been had that stuff. So what, what's up? What's up? Where you going, sir? He like, but you've been through that. The, the house was having issues, but y'all asked us chose not to fix them. She like, babe, what's going on? Don't be fighting him. Uh-uh. Mind your fucking business. Mind your business. Take your ass back in the house. Mind your business. So, like, babe, why are you putting your hands on him? She like, cause he got you living like this. What do you, What do you mean? And he ain't trying to fix shit. Mind your business, sis. Mind your business. He's trying to handle stuff.
He was like, nah, bitch. Now you can cry. Now you can cry. Now you can go about doing all that little fuck shit. But what you, when it comes to mine, you're not finna fuck her over. You're not finna fuck her over. And she like, she angry. She like from Myers. It's mice in this fucking house. Everything is trash in this house. I don't want to have mice in here. She like, can you please take care of these fucking mice? Can you please take care of the mice? Can you take care of the mice? She said, are you sitting on my computer? We will beat you up, our boy. Get the fuck up from my computer before I really kill your bitch ass. She like, clean the fucking house. So get dusty, crusty ass. You don't see all the fucking my... Listen, I don't have time for this. She's like, get the fuck out of my house before I kill you. All right, so right now, y'all, we probably gonna be moving out of here soon. Um, we gonna end the episode here, but before we get too far, we probably gonna be moving out of here soon because it's just a really bad conditions uh, for us. Uh, one of these kids are probably gonna go with Asia, and I'm thinking that Asia is gonna take the gray one because it's cute and we don't really have room for all of our kittens. But we are thinking about getting a new place already because we're moving in with um old dude but like he's not our boyfriend yet so we want to talk to him about that in the next episode because she like just having rats in your house and roaches and stuff she like he didn't say nothing about this um before this happened he never said anything about it so i didn't know what's wrong with you hello put some food in here get up sis so like, i had no idea Get up and give Sophie some food. Um, so like Sophie has food in there. Go eat. Sophie sleep, girl. Live alone. Um, and what is this by this cat? Wake up, Milo. What's wrong with Milo? What's wrong with Milo? What's wrong, baby? Why is this? What is this line right here? Look at him and her. They so cute. Anyway, guys, that's where we're going to end the episode off. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great one. Peace.